Hello, uh, goddesses. This is Mally Oz. Uh, I'm the Holistic Tooth Fairy, and I am the uh, spotlighted member this week. And I am going to talk about how your teeth uh, really want you to be living a good life. Your teeth want you to be happy, to enjoy pleasure, um, to feel good, to feel fulfilled. This is actually what your teeth want for you. It might not feel like it when your teeth are uh, giving you trouble, but um, they're only uh, niggling at you or giving you pain or sensitivity um, when uh, you're not in alignment with uh, living a really good and pleasurable life and that's when problems happen. So they're, they're like a wake up call. So um, what lots of people are surprised to find out is that teeth are alive. They are not like lumps of rock in your mouth. They are um, uh, dynamic, uh, vibrant, living organisms uh, that respond uh, quite fast to um, nutrition, to what you eat, to how you're feeling, what you're thinking, to how relaxed you are or how tense you are, how stressed out you are. Um, and your teeth, uh, the health of your teeth is really um, uh, governed by what goes on inside of your body, not what you put on the surface of your teeth when you're brushing them or your oil pulling or um, your, you know, any other kind of oral hygiene uh, approach is really secondary to the health of your teeth because they are um, uh, uh, regenerated, restored from the inside out. There's a process called dentinal flow which uh, drives uh, nutrition, uh, nutrients, uh, hormones, proteins, oxygen, um, and fluids through the bloodstream into the roots of your teeth and then out through the pulp, through the dentin, through the enamel to remineralize the surface of the teeth drop by drop. And so um, it's very much everything that we are concerned about with our teeth, cavities, decay, abscesses, infections, the colour of our teeth, it all comes from the inside out. It's not uh, from the surface inwards. Um, so, um, I have been um, taking care of my own teeth holistically for about six years now. I had really terrible teeth all my adult life. I had six root canals and then about six years ago, I was able to uh, stop what would have been my seventh root canal by changing my diet, and that set me off on this whole journey of learning about uh, natural oral health. And um, uh, one thing that has really uh, come to my attention as I've been uh, healing my own teeth and then a couple years ago starting to support other people as a coach to heal their teeth is that this idea that our teeth want us to have fun. I've really noticed that the people who have the chronic uh, and serious problems with our teeth and gums, those of us who have lots of fillings or a history of root canals or just one thing after another or our gums are really badly receded, we all have in common that we're quite serious people. We're quite um, earnest, we feel like life is quite hard, um, that we have to struggle, uh, that um, we don't deserve for things to be easy. This is a really common trait with uh, the people I see who have problems with our teeth, um, particularly chronic problems. And um, so, I've also noticed that the people that get the best results from uh, using holistic teeth healing strategies who are actually able to um, dramatically heal major problems, prevent root canals, um, remineralize cavities, uh, restore their gums, um, things like that, things that uh, many dentists say can't be done, they are the people who have been really willing to embrace this idea of living with more joy and more pleasure um, and 
uh, fulfilling their soul purpose in this really light-hearted and playful way, they're the ones that are actually able to heal their teeth. So it's not uh, just coincidence or my strange lack of fashion sense that means I whoops, wear flowers in my hair <laughs> and that I call myself the holistic tooth fairy and sometimes I'm even seen in fairy wings. I do all this playful um, presentation to role model the kind of light-hearted uh, idea of pleasure and fun that our teeth want for us. Um, uh, it's like the opposite of going to the dentist, which for most of us is a very heavy and hard and difficult and painful experience. So I um, really uh, try and make sure that the experience of working with the Holistic Tooth Fairy is very light in contrast to that. So, what can you do to give your teeth pleasure and to help them to uh, be healthier? Uh, one of the uh, first things that I like to get people to do is actually to relax your jaw. There's a lot of tension in our jaws. Most of us don't even realise how tense our jaws are unless uh, we've been told or we know that we're grinding or clenching. Um, uh, that's one of the symptoms or two of the symptoms of a, of a tense jaw but uh, there's there's more going on than that. Hello I can see someone's watching um, please say hello in the comments and if you've got any questions about uh, holistic teeth healing happy to answer questions but what I what I'll do for people who are watching the recording is show you how uh, you can very easily and quickly um, relax your jaw and allow more um, of that dental flow to reach your teeth. So when our muscles are tight in our jaw, that tension is kind of clenching down on the bloodstream and making that dental flow quite sluggish. So when we relax our jaw, then the flow of um, all the good healing nutrients is much uh, more free and the body's able to do the restorative work that it comes naturally to it. Um, so uh, a really easy way to relax your jaw is just to do a big yawn or say the word wow in a really exaggerated way. Wow is a big stretch and some people will um, have, be clicky in the jaw. So um, just be careful, you don't want to hurt yourself if you are very, very um, tight in here. Don't push it too far. This is something to practice gradually over time and build up your ability to open your mouth very wide. But saying wow just stretches everything out and then it relaxes back in like you've stretched um, a rubber band and it's um, a little bit looser. Um, so I would encourage you to uh, say wow or do a big fake yawn a few times in a row, like 10 or 15 times in a row, at least once a day, and just let the blood flow into your gums, into the roots of your teeth, and enjoy that um, kind of, um, it's almost like a tingling sensation when um, uh, you're bringing the life force into your jaw. So no matter what kind of teeth problems you've got, whether they're teeth problems or gum problems, um, everything in our mouth goes better when our jaw is relaxed. So it's, it's uh, one of the four central pillars of my approach to holistic teeth healing. Hello Heather, I can see you're watching. Um, uh, feel free to say hello or ask questions. Um, let me know if you can hear me okay. So um, the other three pillars besides relaxing the jaw are nutrition because our teeth uh, really <clears throat> respond well to eating good food. Um, in particular our teeth like us to eat fat soluble vitamins and those are found in um, all kinds of delicious foods like butter um, and uh, raw milk or full cream milk, um, 
fish has got lots of fat, fat soluble vitamins and shellfish in particular and caviar so treat yourself and your teeth to some caviar if you like that um, and there's also um, plenty of teeth nourishing foods that uh, you can eat if you're not into the animal products so um, all the things that you know are good for you like the um, dark leafy greens and and those kind of things but also uh, anything with a, a lot of minerals is going to support your teeth your teeth need calcium phosphorus iron magnesium and uh, seaweeds are a really good source of um, of minerals so I encourage you to uh, eat sushi or um, other kinds of uh, cuisine that include seaweed in them um, uh, also um, nettle tea is great so if you're into herbal tea nettle is a really good one for your teeth and for your general health then the third pillar of holistic teeth healing is oral hygiene and everyone knows about brushing and flossing but um, not everyone knows that it's more important to get the technique right than to have the perfect toothpaste there's actually no such thing as the perfect toothpaste so to uh, when you're brushing and flossing um, the correct technique is actually a really pleasurable and sensual and mindful approach to uh, teeth brushing. It's not a kind of um, automated, mechanical and heavy handed approach. There's lots of uh, sensitive nerve endings in your gums and in your mouth and when you're brushing appropriately, that is gently and mindfully, then it feels really good. That's another way that adding pleasure into your life supports the health of your teeth and then the fourth uh, strategy uh, for healing teeth is uh, encompasses all the metaphysical so the psychological the emotional the um, spiritual and the ancestral and um, this is a big uh, category of uh, approaches to teeth healing um, but Probably if you only take one idea away from this, it would be to uh, have fun, seek out pleasure, be gentle on yourself and uh, don't hold back from pursuing your life purpose because all of those things will support your teeth and gums to be healthier, it will help to remove blocks to healing, it will help to activate your body's innate ability to heal. So, um, if you'd like to find out more about holistic oral health, come along to my Facebook page, The Holistic Tooth Fairy, and, um, and let me know if you've got any questions, ask questions in the comments, and I'll come back and, and answer them later. Thank you for watching, and uh, thank you for having me in the group, and I'll see you around. And remember, you're the boss of your mouth. Bye.